I wanted to go ahead and uh, show the people out there that's new to uh, whelping litters or whelping puppies um, if they had to bottle feed a puppy. Um, pretty much how I do it, uh, but I am going to title the video how to bottle feed uh, your puppy. Um, so I just wanted to go ahead and share some of the tips that um, I didn't came across and learn uh, throughout uh, all the litters that I didn't whoop so far and just try to share some of that information with you guys. So uh, we're going to go ahead and dive into it. Uh, I'm going to be bottle feeding Blue Ranger. What it do YouTube, you already know it's your boy L and we are back with another Sand Bullies Kennel video. And in today's video, man, we got the pups out, man. We just did the uh, two week update. Um, so I thought about um, how I can give y'all a tip um, because I was uh, in the, the middle of uh, bottle feeding. So um, I know I didn't show up for the very, very first litter. Um, I do know how to tube feed, bottle feed, uh, give IVs and stuff like that. So I wanted to share the information and um, it's time for the pups to eat anyways. Y'all can see the boy uh, Rocket. Rocket, he up, he, he, I don't know, he like, what's going on right now but uh anyways y'all i wanted to go ahead and uh show the people out there that's new to uh whelping litters or whelping puppies um if they had to bottle feed a puppy um pretty much how i do it uh but i am going to title the video how to bottle feed uh your puppy um so i just wanted to go ahead and share some of the tips that um i didn't came across and learn uh throughout uh, all the litters that I done whooped so far and just try to share some of that information with you guys. So uh, we're gonna go ahead and dive into it. Uh, I'm gonna be bottle feeding Blue Ranger. Um, yeah, so I got this bottle made already. And uh, let's go ahead and jump into it. All right, y'all, so I got his bottle. And at first I wasn't even thinking about it, but then I was like, y'all, I'm gonna sh go ahead and show y'all um, how I do it. Uh, because uh, it's just not like just feeding them the bottle. Uh, I learned the hard way last time. I learned the hard way. So um, what I'm gonna do is, I, how I do it, I go ahead and try to give him some of the bottle first. Um, give him some of the bottle first, and then uh, once Panchi uh, is uh, ready, like I could have Panchi in here, but I wanted to go ahead and show y'all real quick on how I do this. All right, y'all. So he didn't, he didn't got used to the bottle a little bit. He didn't got used to this bottle. So what I'm gonna do is uh, pretty much show y'all. So you never wanna, you never wanna kind of like bottle feed him like this, like a baby. You know what I'm saying? You don't wanna bottle feed him like that. Um, uh, you kind of want to make sure that they uh, they kind of like level like this. So um, as if they like on their mama. So um, how I typically do it, I sit over there in my chair, but I wanted to go ahead and demonstrate to y'all how I do it. So um, he could be sitting up, he a little bit older than a, a brand new newborn. A newborn, a newborn is not going to know how to really, you know, suck and um, pretty much like swallow and, you know, do their thing. So because he been doing it for a little bit, he, he kind of like a little, he a little veteran at it. So uh, let's see him. All right, so now since he didn't notice, so uh, at first they're going to be excited. They're going to be excited. Um, it's really, you can do this wrong and you're supposed to like lay them down, lay them down to where they're on their chest. But like I said, uh, Blue Ranger, he's a little bit more advanced than other puppies, man, in that litter. So uh, I just kind of hold him at this angle right here, man. Um, so uh, that way his head is up and it's kind of like as if he on one of the top, the, the top nipples. Um, and I just hold him at that angle right there. Normally I'll put my pinky out there like that so he could put his paws on my pinky because they, they normally like push and stuff like that when they when they drinking. So I kind of still want him to uh, 
be able to use his paws and stuff like that. Um, but you definitely don't want to flip them over and um, that way they can't aspirate. Another thing is make sure you got a, a bottle that's suited for uh, aspiration. Um, I went through like three bottles and finally I, I like this one the best. Um, and it kind of like regulates how much milk comes uh, through the nipple. Um, you know what I'm saying? And then he's a pretty strong sucker. So, um, I mean, you definitely need that when you got those, those um, very, very strong pups. And again, uh, I don't have to do this. It's just that I wanted them to all be, you know, pretty much gaining the, the weight consistently amongst the whole litter. Um, and I didn't want him to fall too much behind because I kind of had him stationary on each nipple. And then I noticed early on, like, wait, uh, you know, the pups that's on the, on this nipple versus this nipple is not gaining as much as the pups that's in the middle. So I started rotating them, but, um, uh, still, I feel like they're still lacking in the sense. So, um, this, uh, and then you could do it based off weight too. So you don't want to overfeed them. Like I said, I just made them a little bit. Um, and then, oh, and then you don't want the air to get in there too. So he pretty much done. So what I do is just like a baby. I, after he, uh, you know, bottle feeds, he look, he's still, he's still at it. He's still ready, but they don't know. They still young. So you, even if you think that, uh, even if you think, um, that he's still hungry, he, he will drink and drink and drink and drink till he explodes. So you gotta regulate how much you give him. So uh, I don't wanna tell y'all what, how many milliliter, milliliters and, or cc's to give him. You're gonna have to kind of like do your own research on that. Um, you know, I'm not a vet, but uh, definitely man, um, after you feed him with the bottle, you just kind of wanna pat him, man, just like a baby. Just like a baby, make sure, they, make sure he burp. Make sure you burp, and you'll know when he burp. So what I do is for him is like how I just fed him first. Typically I have Pinchy in here already and the other pups be feeding. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 that was good, huh? Yeah, that was good. So I, I did wanna go ahead and jump on here and get this, uh, this video done for y'all. Like I said, it was right after the, uh, right after the uh, two week update. And this boy, he's still hungry, but hey, uh, you gotta regulate how much. Oh, and there you go, he finally just burped. So it's just like a baby, man. You bottle feed, cause they can get bloated, stuff like that, and you don't want it. See, he still want more, but uh, you know what I'm saying? He gonna have to, uh, once the other puppies, once the other puppies, you know what I'm saying, get their milk, then he could go ahead and he could just, you know, I could put him on that front, that front nip that doesn't have that much, that much milk. Um, you know what I'm saying? And I guess he'll be able to like, you know, feel like he, he satisfied. But um, for the most part, you definitely don't want to overfeed him. So that, that was uh, pretty much how much uh, formula I give him. Hey boy. But hey, that's how you bottle feed. Um, you kind of, like I said, um, you want to make sure that the puppy is not like on his back. Uh, you don't want to feed him like a real baby. Um, you definitely want them to be, I didn't see some people lay them down, lay them down and make sure that their, their neck is up. But I mean, they're puppies, so they, he not going to want to just sit there. They like to like push for the nipples and stuff like that. So you kind of got to just work with them. And uh, that's why I just lay them, whether I'm sitting in the chair over there or uh, I'm sitting down here, I just kind of lay them, lay them up this way. Come on, work with me, Blue Ranger. But yeah, just make sure, just make sure that it's, it's, it's imitating them being on the nipple. So typically when they go on that top, that higher nipple, they will uh, kind of look like when they land down, they will kind of look like this. So that's what you kind of want to imitate. Again, I'm not a vet. I'm just trying to show you guys the way I do it. And if you 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 know if you decide to use my method or something like that, um, I think it'll come in handy. And you always kind of want to have different type of methods in your arsenal. Like I said, I know how to tube feed. I could have tube feed him and it would have been way faster. But um, I feel like he, a, you know, he a strong sucker. Um, I don't feel like he will aspirate, um, you know what I'm saying? He could still aspirate, but I don't think so. 
I don't think so. Um, so that's why I decided to go ahead and bottle feed him. If they were, if he was young, week one, I would definitely be tube feeding. I wouldn't do the bottle at all. So if you guys know how to tube feed, if you if you learn how to tube feed, that will uh, save you some time. Tube feeding is definitely faster than bottle feeding. Um, and it's just, you know, seconds and you're done. You can move on to the next pup. But like I said, man, he was pretty strong. Um, so yeah, man, that, that, that's it, man. That's how you bottle feed a baby puppy or a puppy. Um, so I hope this video was helpful. Um, so anyways, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, turn on the notice so you don't miss the next Saiyan Bullies Kennel video that we do. And if you got an Instagram, man, follow us over there on Instagram. We'll be posting some of the pups. And um, yeah, we're about to go get the mama. They're gonna feed and they're gonna really fill up. Um, hit me up for available puppies. Um, you know, so you can put your imprint on your pup and yeah, that's going to be it, man. So again, I hope that video was helpful and, um, I'll catch you guys in the next one, man. Y'all already know what it is. It's your boy L. It's saying bullies and I'm out of this thing. Peace. You know,